Hey guys, I just wanted to do a quick hit here real quick um, to help you guys do a little bit more, a little bit better research. So for this one, I went over to facebook.com. I just typed in funny shirt at the top and I went over here to pages. Now let's look at what comes up. A bunch of pages about funny shirts. Hmm. Let's pick a big one. Funny shirt. 18,000 people like it. Oh, these are in different languages, but you can see they're scaling out designs there. I don't know what that is, what that means. Something, oh, that's uh, Legends Are Born in August in a different language. Uh, Legends Are Born in March. Looks like somebody is on, eh, that might be Custom Cat. I don't know who does those. There we go. Lots of posts here. Man, they just keep, there we go. That's kind of cool. It's on a sh shoe. Hmm, nothing really great on this one. Let's look at funny shirts. Again, somebody has been scaling out in different languages. There's an idea. Uh, there we go. Funny shirts, music in mind. Here's something to take away from this. They're not just putting stuff on shirts. If you haven't scaled past shirts yet, if you haven't moved through that, then I highly recommend that you do. It is a wide open world out there. You can always go to, let's go to Etsy and let's see what's there. Just go to clothing. They have a subcategory of tops and tees. Let's see. Buy this guy a shot. He's tying the knot. There you go. Put a couple different images on there. Uh, this guy is 40. This guy is happy. Look at this is somebody who's taken the same. This is somebody who's using phrases. I like this. Uh, this guy, buy this guy a shot. He's tying the knot. This guy is going to be a pappy. This guy is going to be a groom. This guy is 40. They're taking that same two thumbs and they're scaling it. And it looks like they're getting some sales. So that's good. Let's look at Nap Queen. That's funny. Good. Let's do, um, let's search for funny shirt. Ride or die until about 4 p.m. or so. Shroot Farms, trademark violation. Uh, the book was better. Deal with it. Lake life. I think there's some lake phrases that are trademarked. You might want to look into that one. Um, I have a good heart, but this mouth, that's funny. My favorite people call me, of course. Uh, there's a fine line between numerator and denominator. Only a fraction will understand. That's funny. It's a good math shirt. Uh, just going through here, guys, there is no shortage of phrases. Always, always, always start with your phrases. Been drinking. That's funny. That was probably a good 4th of July seller. So, yeah, I hope that helps. Uh, Dad cubed. But first, Pepsi. Uh, that's direct <laughs> trademark violation. Kind of sweet, kind of salty. So that is just kind of an overview, guys. I just wanted to throw something out there and give you a couple ideas of some other places to... I mean, look at this. This guy sold 926 reviews, which is way more than that. And all he did, I don't, I mean, who knows if these uh, popped on here. She's obviously has a shirt with boobs on it. And look, it's selling. Holy God. Look at all these. Somebody's mad. I hope you guys aren't in our group if this is your stuff. But holy cow, they are selling the hell out of that boob shirt. I have a feeling we're going to see a bunch of those now. Your designs don't have to be great, guys. <laughs> Talk to you later. Bye.